Eagle Creek, just outside of Leavenworth. This is Educated Guests. Hey, welcome to Educated Guests. My name's Lance. I'm one of the guides here at Wildwater River Guides. Um, just got off the ricochet stretch of Icicle Creek. Flows just a little bit under 800. Good medium, uh, medium low flow. Uh, let's take a look at what else we did this week. Over on the west side, the middle middle Snoqualmie got a good spike last weekend, and we were able to get a couple laps in at just about three grand. And if you were wondering about fall in the wall access, it's still a couple weeks out. The Wenatchee is holding out above four grand, turkey shoot is chill, and the best surf is probably over at Granny's Wave. Yesterday we headed over to the Skycomish range to get on top tie. The flows are very good and medium, and we had a great time. If you're in the area and have solid class 4 skills and want to step it up a bit, check out Top Tie. It's a great steep creek and all the major drops are easy to scout, set safety, and portage. After a Top Tie lap, we headed down to the Run the Sky at about 5300 CFS. And let's take a look at what we can expect for the weekend. On the east side, things will probably be the same with the Wenatchee holding out in the 4,000 range. Middle Icicle will still be in, and so will Pashastin Creek. On the west side, things have bumped up a bit from the recent rains. Right now, the sky is rounding out at 8,500 CFS, so you can expect it to stay above 6,000 for the weekend. This means top tide will also be in, if not high. The Snoqualmie is rounding off at 3,500 currently, so it can be expected to hold above 2,000 for the weekend. The Green River is climbing above 2,100 as it is, and might stay above 2,000 depending on how much the dam releases. Thanks for watching Educated Guests. Um, from all of us here at Wildwater River Guides, and thank you. Check us out and follow us on social media, Wildwater River Guides. Um, stay tuned for next week for the next installment of Educated Guests, and uh, be sure to check out the link for the uh, review of the new Icon dry suit from Kokatat.